Hello, I'm Reese Williams. Welcome to another edition of Razor's Edge for Rookies. This month's tip is going to be how to create a custom business rule. Now, you might be wondering, what exactly is a business rule? Well, if you have Razor's Edge and you ever open up, say, a record that is, say, a board member, well, what will happen is you'll be given this additional prompt. You'll notice it says this constituent is a board member. Now, what this is is an actual business rule that is set up as a default rule in Razor's Edge. But what you might not know is that you can make a rule for just about any kind of situation. So let's say, for instance, you would like a prompt similar to this for every time you open a member of the finance committee. Well, an easy way to do that is you would go create a query of anyone in the finance committee. Now, just for brevity's sake, I've already built one. And to show you what it would look like, committees are kept track of in the attributes. So on the left-hand side, you would go down to where it says attributes, you'd open up specific attributes, and scroll down to where it says committees. And then using the committee description, this is the filter. You want to say constituent specific attributes description equals finance. Give it a name of finance committee, and now you're ready to go build a rule. Now once you have the query in place, you can come over to this section on the config. Now you'll need the rights to get into this area in the event you don't. So if you're not an administrator, you might not even see this, but that's where it's at. Now under this section where it says business rules, if you click that, you'll see a bunch of options, but what we're looking for is this one here, user defined rules. And the way you can build a rule is you'd say new opening constituent rule, and you'd give it a name. In this case, we'll call it finance committee. And then you select the query that you built. Easy way to find the query is just find the one that you built today and chances are it's right there and then you put your message. So you'd say this uh, person is a member of the finance committee. Pretty simple. Now once it's done and it's applied as a rule you can go to any record any person that has that attribute on their record, and I believe I set this one to do so, to give you an example, you'll get this prompt. This person is a member of the Finance Committee. Well, that's your tip of the month. I hope that helps. And for all of your training needs, check us out at RaisesEdgeForRookies.com.